morning, everyone. Good morning, good morning, good morning. And welcome to day three, y'all. Day three of our 31 daily scripture reading challenge. Today is August the 3rd of 2022. Of course, y'all know I have my Jesus Calling book. I'm not going to read the whole thing today because as you can see, I've already made it to work, y'all. I was running a little behind, but God is still good. So the scripture that I have for y'all today is coming from Ephesians 4 and 29. Ephesians 4 and 29, and it reads, Let no corrupt communication proceed out of your mouth, but that which is good to the use of edifying, that it may minister grace unto the hearers. And grieve not the Holy Spirit of God, whereby ye are sealed unto the day of redemption. That's Ephesians 4 and 29. But in my little daily devotion book, it says, Ephesians 4 and 29 says, Do not let anyone unwholesome talk out of your mouths but only what is helpful for building up others according to their needs, that it may benefit those who listen. Y'all, I tell y'all all the time, there is life and death in that tongue. Speak good things over your life. If the devil bring up some things that's not like God on your mind, you don't have to say it. They say, if you don't have anything good to say, Hey, don't say nothing at all. We need to say things that others can benefit from. Positive things, y'all. Good things. We have to speak good things into existence. And also, just because it come up, that don't mean you have to say it just because it come up. You know, God, he is not. He's not the author of confusion. So just say things that you can build other people up with. And also, you can speak positive things over your life. I love y'all. Be great. Be the best you that you can be. Put God first in everything you do. And I promise you, everything else will fall in line. I will see y'all tomorrow for day four. God bless you all. Peace.